The Waltham School Committee this week approved a one-year contract extension for Superintendent Susan Nicholson, after which Nicholson announced she would be stepping down from the position at the end of next school year. Uh, my family circumstances have changed. Many of you know that I became a grandmother in April. My grandson was born April 22nd, and I would like to be in a position to help my daughter with her son like my mother helped me. So a year from now, I will be needed uh, to help my daughter. I would like to thank the school committee, past and present, for helping me. To fulfill my goal of becoming a superintendent, it has been a wonderful experience being the superintendent of schools in Waltham. We have had an opportunity um, to keep the superintendent for another year, um, and I'm very happy that she's staying on. Um, I think she's worked hard. I think she has brought the district um, to a place where we can uh, have um, confidence that people are working, people like to come to work, and I'm, with any decision that you make, you're going to have detractors. But I think this, the superintendent has brought the district to a place of professionalism, and I want to just appreciate her for hard work that she's done for the city of Walton. One school committee member, Edmund Tarallo, said he could not support the contract because it included a 12 percent raise, which he said was fiscally irresponsible. Nicholson said she would be using part of her raise to establish a scholarship for a Waltham High School senior as a way of giving back to the community. For the Waltham News Watch, I'm Bill Heatley.